trick or treat. Here's your scam. You got it? So this here is the new CNC from Inventables, the X-Carve Pro. Now similar to the original X-Carve, pretty much only in name. So this has a four foot by four foot work area, also available as a four by two. And it took me under two hours completely to assemble this, including leveling the wasteboard. And it comes with everything, including the spindle, all the controls, the wasteboard, everything. So it's ready to go out of the box. And it all operates on a single plug with regular house power. So with that, this is really a professional level CNC router. And because of all that stuff that I mentioned, I think it's a perfect machine for a garage workshop environment like this one. So I already cut my finger on the CNC. Actually, I cut five of them. Get it? So I'm gonna quickly go through the evolution of that prototype and then we'll get to cut the real thing. So the first prototype here, I was trying to keep the back as seamless as possible, but that allows it to bend past being straight. I fixed that in the next prototype by adding these little shelves in the back. And then I started playing around with the mechanism that's gonna pull the finger. Then I refined the model to cut that slot with the CNC added in a bungee cord. It wasn't quite strong enough, so I had to step that up with a larger bungee cord, which still wasn't quite strong enough, but I was able to figure out how to embed it so it's kind of hidden in there. And then the final prototype, I refined where the pull string was located, got the right size bungee cord in there, and then it springs right back to where we want it.
I kind of jumped ahead a little bit and went ahead and carved one of the hands off camera just so I could kind of get the hang of it. So I temporarily glued all the pieces together so I could freehand carve the hand to shape. So after I was done carving, I separated all of the pieces and then I was able to hop back over to the CNC and carve out the inside of the palm on some of these pieces to take off weight. So now I can go ahead and repeat that process on the second hand. And I have the benefit this time of having the profile set so I can trace these side profiles on all these pieces connect the dots, and then I'll have a hand that is identical to this hand. On the other hand though, I still have a lot of sanding left to go on this piece first. On the other hand. Pause the carving now while I still have enough flat area to clamp the thumb onto this piece here. So I'll still have access to pin this joint, and I'm only taking the weight off the three center fingers, so I should be good to go to carve off this backside once the glue is dry. So I know we're all going through a lot right now. This whole distancing stuff, it's really starting to wear on us. And that's not gonna be any truer than during this holiday season. So that's why I invented these. 
Stay six feet away from your friends and family and do activities just like you used to. It's almost like they're not even there. <laughs> Trick or treat. You got it? You got all those? Good enough. You can eat that. Damn, I can't reach my m and oh, wow. oh, I got it. Let's go. Santa's here. It's for you. Oh, boy. It's for you. Oh, boy. Thank you for joining me for that build, the first project in my new shops, and I hope you'll support it on Kickstarter too. A couple of minor tweaks to work out, but I really think this has a chance to revolutionize the world. Anticipated to start shipping in April 2028. It's also the first project using the brand new Inventables X Carve Pro CNC. I'll put a link down below so you can learn all about it, see all the specs, and it's currently on pre order, so that means there's a massive discount on the price. It's such a robust and well built machine, I really haven't scratched the surface of it yet, but it's really going to increase my capabilities in this new space. But it was perfect for this hand because it allowed me to do rapid, repetitive prototyping and do little tweaks to the finger until I worked out all the arthritis. But when I said the X Carve Pro is ready to go out of the box, I was not joking. They include things their competitors don't, including bits dust collection and an actual human being in the box that helps you assemble the machine. Now that I think about it though, I think that might have been special treatment for the pre-release unit. So you might want to check on that. And if you follow me on Instagram, you've already heard that joke, but that's what we do around here. Recycle, even my jokes. Well, I'll be monitoring all the comments. If you have any questions about the new CNC, the new workspace, anything else, it might be a little bit slow to respond. I'll be, cause I'll be using, I'll be using these to, to type. Like, share, subscribe, call your mother. She misses hearing from you. Write a letter to your congressperson. Go visit a pet shelter and visit some lonely animals. Eat some vegetables. Camp, 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 get it. Don't torture it, kill it. <laughs> it's very hard to do, it's not that easy.